To say that soldiers are brave is probably an understatement. Uh, but sometimes, what do you want to know? I mean, <laughs> even a soldier <laughs> I'm very nervous gets I'm, butterflies. That camera is killing me. <laughs> Penyu Inkov is a private in the Bulgarian army. I'm trying to improve my English. And after 10 days of training with US soldiers in the Bulgarian wilderness, he's up against what might be his toughest test yet. An interview. I can't. I can't explain it. <laughs> it's strange. But <laughs> What's easier for Private Inkov to explain is what he and his unit have been going through with their U.S. counterparts. We've been four days in the woods. I mean, uh, um, four days we we're sleeping uh, bed to bed, uh, shoulder to shoulder. I mean. Uh, and he's not uh, complaining because it's training like this that may one day save his life. Uh, I'm trying to remember everything because. Um, it can be useful in the missions in Afghanistan, Iraq, or somewhere in the world. Private Inkov has a family back home, and they've watched him leave and come back from Afghanistan twice now. But if he has to go again, he says there's something he'll look forward to. I was taking a picture with the guys with, from the platoon, and I was thinking, did I meet them? Did I meet them again somewhere in the world? And if he does, he knows what he'll tell his family in Bulgaria about the American soldiers he'll be working with. When they ask me how they are, uh, what uh, kind of people they are, the American troops or something, I'll explain to them that, uh, that they're absolutely professionals, absolutely. They're nice people, nice guys. And now that he's wrapped up his interview, right. he can get back to training with them. Okay, All right. that's it. Yeah. That's, it. that's the Army Today from Soldiers Radio and Television, Washington.